Hello everyone, this is me Ali Reza. I'm a Google Ads, Facebook Ads, Bing Ads certified advertising professional as an well owner of a Google partner company with a lot of specialized Google Ads and you know dedicated managers with me and my team. So I'm here with a new case study regarding Google Ads suspension. For those who don't know that we work with Google Ads suspension, Google Merchant City suspension, Google Ads disapproval and Google Ads account setup, audit and management. So I'm here with a new case study regarding Google Ads account which is suspended for unacceptable business practice policy. Now you know we have to understand it and first of all the account was created back in October today it's 9 July at the time of reading this video okay the account had issues from uh, March onwards and you know the first the account had you know uh, ads being disapproved and then suddenly the account went into the suspension and the suspension was the account has the unacceptable business practice policy now you know this was a very panic moment for our client and you know whenever there is a scenario like this you know we do an audit we do everything over here so you can see over here that this is one of their website you know which has an issues so what we did was you know i'm going to show you quick as well okay this was another like you know this was a, not an error but you know the error was regarding this that your account violated the unacceptable business practice policy now you know what we did was uh, we did uh, uh, a dedicated you know uh, audit and you can see over here as well that uh, this is an audit and if i can show you over here as well you know the as we are you know uh, so far have uh, gaining expertise in uh, so sorting out google uh, ads uh, google Bay merchant google business profile and google ads just approval we have created a dedicated 170 plus step checklist you know to find out the exact errors to which can be the reasons you know your account is suspended now you know we find out the placeholder has uh, issues and then we find out the robots.txt file was missing you know page speed has some issues as well you know there were some uh, grammatical errors as well and some you know uh, extra call symbols as well in the website we also suggested some pages to be created uh, needs to be created and then we simultaneously also started discussing with google regarding the issue okay you know i'm going to show you as well you know one thing as well uh, that you know again it's a team effort as well and you know one of my staff member you know when they got in touch with you know google team they says that the uh, the account is still into uh, the volition you know and uh, you know that the, your account cannot be restored over here so you know again it takes a uh, patience and uh, dedication so what we did was we did a compare competitor uh, comparison page to page word to word to see again it uh, requires a lot of uh, patience and uh, you know a lot of work from my staff you know to figure out you know where we are wrong, wrong over here we created another you know audit as well and then you know we figured more errors as well we discussed regarding those as well and then we had a, a dedicated discussion with our uh, google team and our google dedicated manager to uh, get it restored and then you know what happened is that then you know we got a notification on one of our mccs that your account is uh, suspended now what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on the in front of you guys to show you that the account has you know started spending you know and in case if i move on to the notification you can see that an account is unsuspended in case if i uh, do a refresh over here to figure out in case if the account is in uh, unsuspended or not so uh, this is you know uh, i refresh uh, the website in front of you to make sure that nothing is you know fake and you can see that your account is unsuspended your account has been deactivated and is able to run ads again so yeah this is another successful case study then this was you know a quick uh, um, case study and for those who don't know that the account is you know advertiser verified as well and uh, you know again thanks to my team who constantly worked hard to ensure this uh, revival process uh, thanks to the client as well and the team as well who uh, were patient and who were supportive in doing the changes on the website on the ad copies uh, we also thoroughly looked on the account for any violations issues and then you know everything you know when uh, went into the normal then you know we discussed regarding google's and we discussed in various on the cook on the calls on email and we also have a dedicated manager as a google partner company so all of the things combined you know worked to get the account restored so yeah uh, this is another successful case study and in case if you need a professional help with regarding your google ads google business profile google merchant center suspension google ads disapproval or uh, even you know google ads management me and my team can help you all you have to do is to hire us through the link in the description and you know we're going to help you in sorting out your errors plus helping you in management audit and setup of your campaign so yeah we look forward to working with you and in case you have any questions left regarding this case study you are more than welcome to write in the comments of this video and i will be ha happy to answer again if you need a personal consultation the link is also in the description for that as well so yeah thank you for watching uh, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that whenever I create a new video or case like this, you guys can, you know, watch it. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.